Yeah, this is Professor Hoyne. I'm a consultant psychiatrist and professor of psychiatry. And I'd like to present some uh, short ideas about the uh, papers in Global Psychiatry Archives. And this is a paper about um, a practical paper about the um, intervention against suicidal ideation in people who have been newly diagnosed with HIV and who are in a Nigerian maternity teaching hospital. So, you know, the fact is in, in, uh, in, in Nigeria, as in sub-Saharan Africa, there are lots of people living with HIV. And uh, it's a question of how to deal with the suicidality, which can be very common after people have been diagnosed in the first, um, after the first months. So this is a study about compassion focused therapy. And the question is whether the suicidal ideation changes in the intervention group compared to control group. And it's quite straightforward. The um, just to show you the little bit of the um, just hang on the outcome. So they are in the intervention groups, which is randomly associated, they are males and females. Um, the control group uh, has a couple more females. The age is comparable. There's no influence of the age on the, on the suicidality. So age doesn't seem to be a confounding factor because it's comparable in both groups. Right, so what you then see is, um, this is the outcome in table three. You can see the t-test. And what you see here is in, in the intervention group who had uh, compassion focused therapy, there's a significant improvement in the suicidality. Um, and post-test, it's much less. So the intervention group gets a quite a lot of benefit and reduces the suicidality. And the control group, um, in the control group, there's nearly no big difference. And the p-value is highly significant. So the outcome, I don't go into the details. If you're interested, read this paper at www.globalpsychiatry.co.uk. But um, the, it's a simple fact that um, Compassion-focused therapy seems to help in people who have suicidal thoughts and ideas after having a new diagnosis of HIV. Right, that's it. And if you're interested, read it in the paper. I gave you the reference. And uh, if you want to watch more of these ideas, then please have a look. Um, we will publish this, um, these snippets of information, which I think is very practical um, uh, frequently. The other thing is maybe once a critical uh, remark, it seems that the control group didn't, uh, has a really big effect. So the question is whether this is uh, representative or, uh, or it's a very spe specific group and how much of um, this simple compassion focused therapy is on an additional time attributed and spend with the patient compared to the other group. Okay, I wish you a night evening and uh, yeah, have a nice day. Goodbye. Hope you enjoyed that.